I used to race starting at about 12 years old. You know, I was an 80 expert racer, and uh, I got hurt when I was 17 and a half, so I didn't really get a chance to go to any too many bigger bikes. See, I've made this bar here. It's kind of like training wheels, you know, like on a kid's bike. It's got roller blade type wheels on the bottom on each side. An electric motor right here. And uh, it's got an electric shifter for shifting up and down like you would on a normal motorcycle. And the buttons up here. And um, it's just, it's your legs now. You know, you got to think ahead of time. But uh, this is your legs now, that you can't move your legs. Goes up and down in about two seconds. Oh, this is a back brake I made for, you know, people in wheelchairs. So you can uh, have a back brake with your thumb instead of your right foot now. That's the clutch, back brake. Down shift, up shift. I keep my legs on with Velcro straps around my knees and around my uh, ankles right here because when you pull a wheelie and you're already going 80, you know, there's G-force that wants to yank your legs off. If I don't, my knees kind of want to go, you know, leave me. I'd look like Superman going down the street. <laughs> I've had it to 185 miles an hour and it still had more to go. It, it kind of feels good to just leave your wheelchair behind now and then, you know. There we go. Now I'm on. Once that's over there, then I'm cool. And I put my chest usually right there. And then my legs try to fight me usually like they're doing right now. Put my left leg up first. Adjust yourself. Get rid of your wheelchair like that. See, I have no balance, so I get that helmet on as quick as possible. <laughs> Put my strap on. Okay. See, now I start feeling normal right now. You know, no wheelchairness. <laughs> first started driving it just made being paralyzed or being in a wheelchair that much easier because now you don't got to rely on nobody and it feels good to go get away by yourself and it's a good thing to be able to drive and take yourself somewhere. Mm -hmm.